That is it for the news at 10. Next at 11, a vigil for a hit-and-run victim is interrupted by another hit-and-run. Our cameras are rolling as a car slams into a man in the middle of a South L.A. street. A look at the chaos that unfolded. A race against time. Rescuers rush to save a dog whose head became trapped in a tire. Center brought to you by the new 2019 Jeep Cherokee. Embrace every new opportunity with a redesigned exterior and 31 highway MPG. Go to Jeep.com to learn more or visit your local Jeep dealer to test drive one today. You wouldn't do that. So why do you do this? Distracted driving kills an average of nine people and injures over a thousand every day in America. Put down your phone. Lives depend on it. Don't drive intoxicated. Don't drive intoxicated. A sobering message from AAA. The first weekend of a big show in the desert, and that means major delays and closures. We break it down for Coachella fun in Fun Life Traffic. Tomorrow on the KTLA 5 Morning News. Now at 11, chaos at a vigil for a cyclist killed in a hit-and-run crash. The cameras are rolling as the driver slams into one of the mourners. Good evening, I'm Michael Holman. And hi, I'm Courtney Friel. Cher has the night off. The vigil of violence happened in front of a group of cyclists mourning the death of their friend at that same intersection. KTLA's Rick Chambers live in South Los Angeles with that chilling video that some may find disturbing to watch. Rick? Yeah, Micah, ironically, this began as a demonstration and a vigil for that cyclist that was killed just yesterday by a hit-and-run driver. But when all of his two-wheeled friends took over that very same intersection today, things went bad quickly.